Hello, I'm Jam, and I am the scriptwriter of Jake Globox's Piggy Shorts, and I also voice Pony, if you did not know or couldn't tell. Uh, so yeah, if you clicked on this video, you probably want to know how uh, how the Piggy Shorts are made, and this video is going to be behind the scenes of the planning, the script writing, uh, the recording, and I'll talk about the editing as well. Uh, but also guys, I'm going to be talking to you guys about how you can be involved in these films and yeah so make sure you stick around to the end for that and let's get started okay so first things first is coming up with the actual ideas of what the short is going to be so me and jake will head into the dms and have a little conversation about what sort of What's going to go on in the piggy show? What's the main goal? What's going to happen? Who, which characters are going to be involved? That sort of thing. So that's what we discuss in DMs. And once we have the idea, for example, in this uh, short, which we're going to be the behind the scenes looking at, is the TSP audition short. Um, we thought of like a little like X Factor type uh, piggy short. And that was the idea to go with. And yeah, I sort of made that. Uh, idea come to life in the script and that's what we're gonna look at next so let's have a look at the script okay so here we are on dynalist now i use dynalist uh, to write scripts but there are other websites and different apps that you can get that you can write scripts with however i think that dynalist is the best personally because everything is laid out perfectly and it's just very simple and easy to use if you want a tutorial i'm sure there's tutorials on youtube i might even try and find one and link one down below but if there isn't one linked then i'm sure you guys can go and find it but it's pretty easy to pick up and yeah and there will be spoilers for the the piggy short so i recommend that you watch that first this is the tsp auditions piggy short so if you haven't seen that i do suggest that you go and watch that first so here we have the title the title is so I know what, what document I'm working on, and that will be the title of the short, the short that we're working on. So uh, here we have location, for which is the map that we're choosing, the alleys in this circumstance, and the characters that will be involved. Now over here we have the stage directions, so we see that Willow is walking, and then that Lotham, the ca character um, of Lotham is going to see Willow. Uh, like so and the script lines are the dialogue lines are numbered so it's easy in the editing process to kind of like link the different text with the speech so that's what that is so we have Lotham's line excuse me madam and then Willow is uh what is it right okay so bad impressions there I know but there we have the two lines and then there's dialogue along there and that's pretty much how it goes along with the whole script so you've got another location there uh, and then all the way down until the the end so yeah it's pretty easy pretty easy to pretty easy and simple to use and I believe yeah open menu it kind of shows the whole scene so uh, if I'm changing like something in this particular scene I want to know what's in the scene uh, it kind of highlights all this here for me to see what's in the scene, if anything needs breaking down, or whatever I can zoom in. I can delete the whole scene if it needs deleting, instead of deleting it all individually. Uh, and I can also colour the different things, so you can see the location, if that's important to me, like that scene's important, I'll highlight it. So yeah, that's for the script writing process, it's pretty easy. Uh, obviously. Uh, it, some people might struggle with the writing side of it and that's completely fine um, but yeah so it's pretty easy to use that's kind of my sort of overview this is kind of what I do script writing wise but yeah so let's get on to the filming side okay so next up is the recording the filming where we actually uh, film what's going on in the piggy short so basically the writing is taken from words and sentences to actual dialogue and actions and it's really really cool to see that all come to life and come together uh what you've written as well so yeah uh jake does an amazing job directing and the voice actors are so so easy to work with they are actually amazing uh and they just really complete like the whole p 
Piggy Shaw in the end, and it's incredible. Uh, so yeah, an incredible team, and the body actors are also awesome, so you guys in the Discord, who are free to help out, will mainly use the voice actors, but sometimes if we need more people, we'll look at actual in just the general Discord, or the membership, Jake's membership, so if you uh, would like to potentially be a part of these, make sure you become a member on Jake's channel, that would be awesome, hopefully we'll speak to you guys soon so yeah we're really active on the discord so if you guys want to join the discord there will be a link to jake's discord in the link in the link in the description down below as well as mine okay so yeah uh so yeah we after that um we basically once we have the people we go into the accurate piggy roleplay it's usually that one but there are other roleplay games uh so yeah it's tenuous fleas roleplay game so it's really easy to body act, and here we have Ray and Shinoa as Willow and Lotham in the first scene, which you will see, first and last scene that we've done, which you will see in the TSP audition short. And all they have to do is listen to Jake and do exactly what he says. So it's incredibly easy to do and really, really fun. Uh, and uh, in this bit, I am co directing, and I'm actually one of the actors. Uh, in this bit as well so yeah we just listen to jake do what he says and that sort of thing so yeah once jake says that's a wrap a chicken wrap sometimes uh we know that all the filming has been done and the piggy short then goes into the editing phase now uh once it's in the editing phase jake himself actually edits the shorts and creates the thumbnails too so he works incredibly hard on this and to see the feedback that you guys give at the end is makes it all worth it it's incredible so thank you guys nothing nothing none of this could have like happened without you guys so we do appreciate that a lot i know jake does like the most out of anybody he's like he loves you guys i know that jake edits it and then once it's edited he uploads it to youtube where you guys are watching the shorts so yeah it's awesome uh, so yeah that is the editing process the filming process as well and that's about it so hopefully you've learned something in this video and hopefully it inspires you to get into storytelling too it's awesome i actually love storytelling so much and through the through the writing it's really uh, sparked a passion for storytelling as well so that's awesome and i'm thankful uh, to jake for that as well so yeah if you have any questions serious questions obviously uh, in the comments, uh, you can ask those questions about the filming, about the writing. If you guys want to get involved with that, let me know. And yeah, I'll give you some tips and I'll try and answer as many questions as possible. And yeah, if you, you are new, make sure you like and subscribe as it really helps me out a lot on the road to 1,000 subscribers, which is crazy that I'm already so close to that, which is awesome. And of course... If you are watching but you aren't subscribed to Jake, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Go subscribe to Jake. His link will be in the description down below as the video, the TSP audition short. That will also be down below so you can watch that again if you've already watched it uh, and see like all the different elements put all together. That could be really cool. A different way of seeing it, I guess. Okay, so that's it. Hopefully you have an amazing day, afternoon, evening or night. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.